Paul Sakala is with the Wildcat men's basketball team. He joins us from the strip, Paul. Hey, David, as you know, Arizona is one of the very few men's basketball teams that can say they have beaten every single team they've gone up against. Why is that? Well, throughout the year, after a loss, they have always won that second game during the regular season in the Pac-12. And if not, in UCLA's case, for instance, they won the first game before losing that second. And they are continuing that trend here at the Pac-12 tournament. Remember, in the round of eight, the Arizona Wildcats went up against Stanford after losing to Stanford in their last game. They ended up winning last night against Arizona State. The Wildcats avenged that loss in that buzzer beater at McHale Center by beating them here in Las Vegas. And tonight, they hope to pull off that three-peat, if you will, in the Pac-12 tournament by knocking off UCLA in the championship game. What would it mean for you to take home the Pac-12 tournament title by beating UCLA in rematch fashion? I mean, that would be a, a, a huge thing. Uh, Kerr said when we got into the huddle today, he says a revenge tour, basically. Um, so we get to beat UCLA for a Pac-12 championship and get a ring. Uh, it would be a great feeling. What are some of the treatments that they've been doing on you to help you rehab that shoulder? Man, I don't even know their names, honestly. I saw some machines first time, so I got to give a huge credit to, you know, J-Rock, our trainer, our medical staff, our doctors, everybody, you know, we, we put in work and obviously these painkillers are pretty, pretty, pretty good things sometimes. Did they give you an injection? Uh, not, not injection, but we just try to get his shoulder stronger and, uh, and uh, do some, do some rehab. What's it mean for you to get that rematch game with UCLA in the championship? Yeah, I mean we're playing for a championship, so we would be excited whoever we play. Uh, but yeah, I mean it's can't lie, it's kind of a rivalry at this point uh, with all the games we played, all the tight games. So. Yeah, it's going to be really fun. And it's come hungry. Uh, they did beat us last game. We beat them at home, so we're on a neutral site. So we just got to be the hungry team to try to get the win. Back out here live in Las Vegas, UCLA is hoping to accomplish the feat that the Arizona Wildcats did last year. That is win the Pac-12 regular season title and the Pac-12 tournament title. Of course, the Arizona Wildcats, they are hoping for their second Pac-12 tournament championship in a row. Also, lots on the line tonight. UCLA is still playing for a number one seed in the NCAA tournament. They can hopefully, in their mind, solidify that if they can win tonight against Arizona. Meanwhile, Arizona seems to be a solid number two seed in the NCAA tournament, no matter how things shake down. But a win over UCLA tonight would help the Wildcats in their cause of remaining out west for a West Regional as a number two seed. So a lot on the line tonight, of course. We will have full coverage tonight on News 4 Tucson at 10 p.m. The game starts at 8.30 Tucson time, so the game will probably still be going on before our newscast ends. But for now, reporting live from Las Vegas here at the Pac-12 Tournament, I'm Paul Sikala, News 4 Tucson. Back to you, David. All right, thanks a lot, Paul.